So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to start prototyping my mark, which essentially means I'm going to copy all the functions that I have written and put it in mark.cpp. And as soon as I put it in mark.cpp, all I do over here, I'm going to say over here, mark scope resolution. I'm going to add it to the beginning. Okay. And I'm going to create empty functions for myself, empty functions for myself for these empty functions with nothing in them. Oh, sorry. So this is going to be mark and it's going to go like this and I'm going to do it for every single function. So I'll make everything empty functions ready to be implemented. If I have to make a change to their prototype, I'll do it with absolutely no problem. So essentially this will be uh, my function body. So I'm just going to do it like that. So that's that. So that's at the end. This is that one. As you see, I'm just adding bodies to the function one by one. The uh, the default value only s resides inside the prototype, so I remove that one. That one. You see there is no coding involved. I'm just preparing things for my coding. And then anyone that returns, I'm going to return something garbage. Return zero. This one is an integer. Return zero. This one is an integer. Return zero. Return zero. And this one doesn't return anything. This one doesn't return, doesn't return, doesn't return. So we're all good. Nice. I'm going to save it and I'm going to actually compile this. So I'm going to say over here, the uh, uh, control F7. I'm going to compile and see if it works. Perfect. Now I have a ready thing to fill in. And this is how you start programming. You start with all this and you go one by one and you fill in the blanks and you do your marking. We're going to do this the next day you are coming in.